Let's write a C program to check if the entered number is perfect number or not. If the number is 6, the numbers which perfectly divide 6 are 1, 2, 3 and 6. Leave this 6 and add the rest of the numbers and the result will be 6. So the entered number and the addition are equal. So 6 is perfect number. Make sure to leave this the number itself. Don't add it. Okay. So let's write the C program. I'll take couple of variables num count is equal to 1 and sum is equal to 0. I'll ask the user to enter a number and of course store it inside the address of variable num. Now concentrate this condition inside while loop while count is less than num. Don't write less than or equal to if you write equal to you will you will be including the number itself in the addition which will be wrong so condition is count is less than or equal to sorry count is less than num so inside while loop check if num modulo division count is equal to zero if that condition is true add the value of count to the previous value of sum and increment the value of count after the end of iteration of while loop check if num is equal to the sum if that's true the entered number is a perfect number. If not, it's not a perfect number. Okay, let me save this and compile and execute. Let's check for 4. Well, 4 is not a perfect number, we know that. Let's enter a perfect number that is 6. 6 is a perfect number. So let me give 25 which is also not a perfect number. Well, let's enter some perfect number. 28 is perfect number. Okay. So please follow the link present in the description section of this YouTube video for source code notes and discussion about this topic. Stay subscribed to our YouTube channel and blog. Please share this video with your friends online and please do not forget to like this video on YouTube. Thank you.